Hello, my beautiful Scorpions! Welcome to one of our special readings. As you know, loves, the special readings are the one requested, required by you. And today, in this special reading, we are looking for your soul purpose, your life purpose. Many of you have been asking why I am here, or you could ever ask you, you know, certain times like, why in the earth I came here in this life? What's, what's the purpose? What's the point, kind of? Let's see, darlings. And I thank you so much for those who did request this reading. It's always a challenge here, loves, to come in and in tune with the synergies. And today's reading, we are in tune with the light energies. Because we all know we have the dark side, the... Um, and the light side and definitely here the upper hand energies bring in here and bring these messages let's see what's your soul purpose or your life purpose or why you're here on this life there is a purpose there is some kind of contract because we are all coming in here with our will where we are sent here for a reason because sometimes we are sent to help someone other times someone here we done a contract or whatever reason let's see messages for Scorpios if you feel this is something you feel resonates with you or connects with you keep watching if you feel doesn't just let it go this might not be a reading we have the fool We have the moon. We have the seven of pentacles. We have the seven of swords. Ace of cups. Three of wands. Seven of cups. Nine of pentacles. Two of wands. And four of wands. What I am hearing for some of you is live in the moment. Enjoy the day. Enjoy the time. Don't worry too much for certain things. Don't wait for certain things. Do you, whatever here decisions here you make, make it as how you would like to see them. Because that way, you're going to live happy. It's kind of also, there is a simplify your life or live simple or... Don't complicate your life with unnecessary stuff. There's also here a lot of travel for some of you, or you are not gonna live where you were born. I have a lot of cards of traveling here, okay? So many, many of you, you either will travel a lot, either will live in some kind of place, but not where you are. There's also something here about your emotional fulfillment. Just because other people live in a certain way, you don't need to live like them. Just other people think in a certain way, you don't need to live like them or be like them. There's something here about be you and always you. For some of you, you try to, to go after, you know, how other people live or how, um, how everyone does the things. You don't need to do like everyone. You don't need to be like everyone. Oh, that person lives like this. I want to live like them. No, you are your own unique 
energy and you can live like that beautifully let's see first card nine of cups queen of wands ten of cups because I feel here for some of you you have such a great you know view of life or you will love life it's kind of live your life fully ten of wands and page of cups for some of you this kind of life you gotta show to someone someone who doesn't see that okay like the um, the life is beautiful the way it is the way it is given to you because i see a very young soul for some of you you will you could be you know going through life through many things through many challenges but you're still that you know young at heart happy and enjoyment and, and in joyful energy because definitely here happiness stability lives somewhere else yes look at here hierophant ten of pentacles there's something here about that give yourself a breathe to leave what's the ten of wands here the devil knight of swords the sun Yes, definitely it feels something here with them. Um, for some of you, it's kind of like you you always love to live in a very beautiful vibration. And some people might not understand you. Look at this energy here. The fool going away from the moon. You could love the, um, the places where is a lot of sun or the warm sides. Look at here, the sun, we have the devil, we have the, the knight of swords, and we have the sun behind. So for some of you, you really love to, to keep uh, free, because full it's free, sun it's free. For some of you, you love to live a free life. You don't want to, you know, to complicate your life, or you don't want to be stuck in some in places you know this is kind of like some of you might live a minimal life for some of you you are the teacher of someone no matter whoever is that person that somebody here could have the sun in capricorn doesn't necessary to be but for some of you you could teach someone that you don't need to complicate your life with unnecessary stuff or you need to lay, live your life in a freely or simply it's like to see the beauty of the day to see the beauty of life as as well look at here the sun and nine of nine of uh, cups here really speaks about the child energy like you are like a child, like um, a beautiful energy of a child that you really, really, really enjoy to be. It's like a child is happy always for, for little things. Wow. Let's see. What's this night? The, the Page of Cups. King of Cups. Wow. For some of you, for some of you loves, in a previous life, you, you could be going or you could had in a previous life uh, a very short life. 
and that's why you came in this life you will have a long life and it's kind of like I want to live this life like it's my my last day or it's like every day it's a new day I, I definitely see here you leave the moment you are gonna leave the moment it's not like everything is forever that's kind of a thing for some of you as I said you could teach someone like every day it's a new day live every single day Queen of Wands here Knight of Pentacles Four of Pentacles, Five of Wands, Queen of Swords, Four of Cups, and the Page of Swords. Yes, it's kind of like don't overthink for the things we can't fix or we can work. Give give it the moment give it the time and other thing here we we have here which is missing actually into your reading loves the four of swords always always take time and reflect or never rush in doing things allow the things to come it's like somebody here it's kind of like i like i like the comfort but also i like to live my life you know there are so so many people here my my could resonate my could not but it's like you you live you live a life there but you live your own life inside you kind of and many people still guessing how you can live this way or like many people don't understand why you are so happy even so to say that you you can just be happy and enjoy your life many people's like will feel like you you are nuts but also i'm feeling here there is some scorpios here that are enjoying or will enjoy little things in life teeny tiny things in life and even though you will try to have small things or minimal life it's like you always will have enough more than enough like for let's say for example some people are really want to have huge things a lot of things and doing a lot of things like you feel like i'm good with small things or with little things and you always have enough just because you are grateful for little things for small things like somebody here might even feel like I don't know how to how you do this. But I feel here for some of you also you you might not try to to attach to to the earthly things. What I mean through is like you you don't want to get attached to a house. You you don't want to get attached to some places. Because you know we coming and go. So it's like your your way of seeing life it's way much different than others. Like a lot of people get attached to you know, let's say to a ring. When this ring today is, tomorrow is not. Other people, you know, people do crazy stuff, you ensure certain stuff and they want this, you know, for the future and things like that. But you just feel like it's it's just a piece of things and so on. Like the the energy what I'm picking in for you is why we need to complicate things. And this really speaks about that we don't need to complicate life. 
for some of you, you are going to live this kind of life. Or you're going to teach someone. Or you're going to be around someone. That you are going to teach them. These things. What's the Ten of Cups here for? Because look at here, this Ten loves. Ten of Wands, Ten of Cups. It's like the happiness doesn't need much. Because somebody here must be like, well, we need to work hard for what we love and so and so. But this kind of happiness is free. We breathe air for free. Like you feel like it's just enjoying it. I don't know, but I have such a easy energy, easy going energy here. Let's see. Magician. It's like happiness. You are making your own happiness. You are the magician of your own happiness. Chariot. Take it. Move it with that energy. Strength. For some of you, you are, will overcome someone too. You will help someone to overcome their karma here. Okay. So many, many of you, your life purpose or your soul purpose in this life is to help someone to understand that for happiness, we don't need much. For others... For others, you, you will help someone to overcome their karma. You are like the catalyst. It's not like that will influence you in any bad way. But yes, for some of you, you could be a good psychologist or a good listener to, to others. But you are that such listener, but you are not the, the, um, the listener who absorb somebody's energy. It's more likely you, you have your own energy and others' energies cannot get to you. Like, I feel here you are kind of greatly protected here. But again, I feel here many of you, you are going to travel a lot around. You are a traveler. Or you could travel... You know, life by life. For others of you, you are going to change a couple times the place where you live in this life. But that's kind of, we are constantly in an adventure. What advice we have for you, darlings? High Priestess, Six of Pentacles, Ace of Wands. Yeah, you, you're definitely here very, very in tune with your energy, with your spirituality. And definitely here, if it's kind of, if it's not good for you or if it's not stable, why should I stay in? Yeah, Wheel of Fortune. So, Two of Pentacles. I feel here also the universe has your back, loves. You know, whatever you do, it's kind of approve this energy. Again, I don't feel here you are going to stay in one single place in the whole life. I see here a very... It's like you are mobile. Even though you are fixed zodiac sign, the Scorpio I'm speaking, I see... You could be mobile, or you could um, live different places, or you could go a couple places in this world. Or you live in um, several countries, several continents even. Yeah, it's not like you are going to stay in one single place here. And also, for, the, for some of you, you... You could get, you know, in a stable connection later on in life. So 
So that's what I have for you, darlings. Thank you very much, loves. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.